everybody? I'm on 160th Street in uh, Amsterdam. And like I told you, I grew up down there, down that block. And that used to be the Starlight. There used to be a bar called the Starlight. And that's when my mother said she met my father in the bar at the Starlight. It was called the Starlight Social Club. And we lived down that block right there in 517. And I remember, I remember when that used to be a drugstore and uh, it sold candy and stuff like that. I remember when this used to be a cab stand. This used to be a cab stand right here. And my uncle Emmanuel used to hang out right there. They called him Black Emmanuel. <laughs> and I got a friend named Brother Earl. He's from around this neighborhood too. And he know my uncles in them. I didn't know that. But I remember this library right here. And I remember 555 right there. That's 555 Edgecombe Avenue. And right down, I'm gonna see if I can, um, like, see those buildings right there? Those are like buildings. Um, from what I understand, those buildings were formed by the Dutch. Because the Dutch came to New York. I'm going to go up there. I never, only been up this block once. I can't edit the video, but if you go up that block, I don't feel like going up that block. But these are like real old-fashioned homes. And the streets are still cobblestone. And co what I mean by cobblestone is it looks like they were made out of bricks. Like they're real brick. And you would have to always go slow when you go through that block. And you had to go slow when you came down this block right here. Because this used to be all, this used to be all cobblestone also. I remember that building right there, that door has changed. Because it looks like, the, I remember that door, I don't know if I was just real small. But that door used to seem a lot wider. But uh, I remember all of it, I don't remember these. But, you know, but I remember walking down this hill. I remember walking down this hill right here. And you used to have to go slow. Check out this little cat. You used to have to go real slow. Because the cobblestone streets will make the car vibrate real hard. And this is 555. There's Jamel Mansion over there. I remember we used to go over there and play. We were little children. We were children. See this street right here is still cobblestone. Look at that. See that? Still cobblestone. Look at that. But this street right here used to be cobblestone also. And you used to have to go real slow coming down this hill. And I remember like <laughs> my father. One, I think it was my father and my uncle had a car and the brakes went out one time. He was real scared that the car was going to go over, over, the, uh, over the cliff into the polo grounds. That's the polo grounds down there. That's where uh, Yankee Stadium used to be back when Bay Roof was here. That's where Yankee Stadium used to be. And then it moved to 161st, but now it's moved again. And I remember coming through this door right here sometimes. Yeah, this is five. This is 555 right here. 555 Edgecombe Avenue. And this building right here, from what I heard, a lot of black celebrities lived in this building. But I remember, I remember living in this building. My grand, see, there's the polo ground. And then I forgot, I don't see old Yankee Stadium. I don't see new Yankee Stadium either. But I'm gonna chill right here and wait for the bus, as a matter of fact. And then I'll take it downtown. But this is five, see, there's the polo ground. Here's 555. And back then, when I was coming up, I remember it used to be like a canopy that came out here. And I remember we had two doormen. There were two doormen in here. Let me see if I can look at here. There were two, there were two doormen. There were two doormen. And see those elevators? It was two elevators, but they were, they were manual. You had to have an elevator man. And the elevator man used to, it was two elevator men. And uh, the doorman also, and it was two doormen, I think. And they would come, and they would open the door for you, and they would buzz in, they would buzz you in from back there. And see, on the right, there's a staircase, and on the left, there's a staircase, and the mailbox. And uh, they used to have to work the elevators. They used to have to work them manually. And I remember my uncle, at one time, had a job working the elevators. And uh, it has a, a mailbox chute. I remember it had a black, a back alleyway too. There's two staircases, one staircase on the right and one staircase on the left. And uh, like it's spiral, so you could look all the way up. And my grandmother used to live on the 12th floor. My grandmother, and it was, uh, it was I got 14 aunts and uncles on my father's side. And all the children lived in the apartment, so the apartment was small. So you know what they did for my grandmother? My grandmother had the wall taken down, and she had two. She had two apartments on the 12th floor, right up here, on the 12th floor, yep. And at one time, we, uh, my father, and, uh, my father, my mother, and my family, we lived on the 4th floor. I think it was 4E, 
And my mother, my grandmother lived in 12A. And this is 555, Edgecombe Avenue. Yep. My friend brother Earl grew up down there. Down that way. Alright, y'all, I'm out, y'all. Check out the polar bear. I'll talk to y'all later.